What's up, guys? Your boy DJ Stash here, getting another review. Today's episode, I'm reviewing the second of the new uh, sandwich variations from Jack in the Box. This is gonna be the sourdough patty melt. All right, I got it in a combo, so the whole thing for rating says combo. So, yeah, I'm reading off this one, rating since I was saying in the other fish sandwich one that you, if you check that one out, should be side by side with this one. Uh, this was only on Chumbo website now, rating. And I also didn't mention the other video. I don't know if you can hear, but my heater's going on right now. It's fucking. As I record, it's cold as fucking Texas, and this has been like the coldest it's been pretty much the whole somewhere at the beginning of the month of February. <laughs> I've been waiting for it because it's been pretty chill in February. That's how I know global warming is fucking real, guys. Like, it's been like good 70s all all day and night, and now it's been in like in the 40s today. So, anyhow, let me read over here. It says, uh, for limited time, Check in the Box offers up the new $4.99 Super Dough Penny Meal Combo as their latest value meal. The new sourdough patty melt features Swiss and American cheese melted in a grilled beef patties and served with grilled onions on a toasted sourdough bread. The combo also includes small fries and a fountain drink. Uh, it didn't mention it here, but like if you go out to a website or Jack in the Box or the actual store itself, you can actually get a double meat. So I got the double meat. Good thing I did because that fish sandwich is, you know, pretty sad. So we can check that video out. Let's check it out. And this one is actually in a box compared to like the paper wrap and the fish sandwich. I'm already seeing the improvements. <laughs> yep, sandwich itself. Take it out of the little wrapper. Cheers, guys. I'm a pretty fan of sourdough. I like the grilled cheese that they have it there. So I guess it's the kind of same same breading. Uh, it's pretty stuck on there. Yeah. It's like different different kinds of cheeses on there. You can't even pull it apart really. Just because of the double beef, beef and cheese in between. All right, guys. New chicken box patty melt. Cheers. Mm. It's a lot of the bread. I mean, even with the dough meat, I mean, this was meat. If I went for the dough meat, I'd probably just play, just taste more of the sourdough than anything. I don't really get much of a cheese. You know, there's two different varieties of cheese on here. And I'm not getting much of the onions. There's onion right there. It's all in the middle. Same with like that fish sandwich. It's like less condiments. Like, they're fucking skipping you on shit. I don't know what this is, guys. Like, so far, the fucking McDonald's has been skipping you on the bacon. And now, fucking Jack and Watch is giving me on their condiments too. So I don't know if anyone else having problems with it. I mean, I gotta get it as it is. I mean, if you're just into the sourdough, like, definitely pick it up for the sourdough. But I'm gonna have to get some 3 out of 5 as well. It's just kinda average for me. I wanna say, pretty much, be at the same difference as if it was just a single patty. But, pretty disappointed with these averages, burgers, sandwiches right now. What can you do? Alright guys, this is the uh, Jack in the Box new sourdough patty milk. I'm getting a single and a double. So like I said, if you like uh, sourdough, pick it up. You're not going to taste much anything else. This fish sandwich, kind of the same. <laughs> you love the fish, the fried fish. That's supposed to be going to eat out for Jack in the Box. Alright guys, hope you enjoyed this review. If you did, please give us a like, share, and subscribe. And be sure to check out my plugins down below. And be sure to hit that notification bell to stay tuned on my future videos. So you can check me out on videos, honest reviews such as this. Until next time, guys, this is your boy, DJ Stassian. Peace.